failed to make the sequel by an established deadline. She sued them for $100 million, saying, in addition to the money that she wasn't paid, that, um, that she had that she had gotten in shape and had, had done all these costume fittings and had turned down other roles, and so she had lost all this potential income. Ultimately, they settled out of court, but not before a handful of leading men like Vigo Mortensen had turned the role down. Aaron Eckhart was offered $6 million and still didn't want to do it. The studio wanted Benjamin Bratt, but but Sharon was concerned that he was too young and that he would make her look too old. Early reviews have panned the sequel, and Smith jokingly refers to Stone's performance as being so over the top that it elevates a bad movie into a must-see diva extravaganza. She makes Mommy Dearest look small. At 48, to look like that and to move like that and to act like that is pretty remarkable. Of course, for skeptics who think otherwise, there's always this alternative. Want to see sexy? <laughs> All right. Uh oh. Sevilla Vargas, CNN, Los Angeles. Oh, baby, yo. Oh. Thanks so much for joining us. Have a great weekend. See you Monday night. Larry King Live starts right now. Good night. Tonight, former President Bill Clinton on his global initiative, raising billions to try and solve the world's problems, plus his take on Iraq, the immigration debate, and more.